from Southern Country Living and today I'm doing an apple carrot cake and this is a real easy recipe and I think it's going to be good. I've never tried it before and so um, these are the ingredients that goes in it. It's going to be one cup of apple sauce, three eggs, two-thirds cups of oil, and this um, cake mix here. And then the icing is real easy also. It's just uh, one lemon squeezed and uh, cream cheese and powdered sugar. So let me get started on this easy cake and I think it's gonna be really good too. All right, I hope everybody is having a good Friday today. And so let me get started on my cake. So I'm gonna um, put in my cake mix. You can use whatever cake mix you want that's um, a carrot cake mix, but um, I'm using Duncan Hines today. Okay, so I've got my cake mix in, so now I'm going to um, put in my eggs. That's three eggs, and this is two-thirds cups of oil. And I'm going to beat this for three minutes. Okay, I have my uh, cake mix beat up now. So now I'm going to add my apple sauce in. And I'm going to beat this for about one minute. And this is original apple sauce. Oops. Okay, I have that mixed up now, and so I'm going to put my cake mix batter into my sprayed pans, and I also have some parchment paper on the bottom. Okay, so I'm going to put try to do this evenly that that's as even as I can get it right this minute so we'll see how it looks when it comes out but anyway I'm going to cook this at 350 degrees for 35 uh, to well for 30 to 35 minutes okay I'm going to be making my icing now while my cake is uh, baking I'm going to put in uh, some cream cheese And let me get this off my thumb right quick. Okay, I'm gonna beat my cream cheese now. Okay, 
Okay, so now I'm going to be adding one cup of powdered sugar. And uh, one lemon. Squeezed. Now I have my icing mixed up and when my cake comes out of the oven uh, and it's slightly warm, I'm going to be putting my icing on it. Uh, and this icing is real easy to make and it should be good on the cake. And I think I'm going to taste a little bit of it and see how I like it right now. Mmm. That's really good. <laughs> Okay, so I'll be back soon as my cake is finished. Okay, my cakes are done now, and so uh, when they cool off, I'll put my icing on them. Mmm, they really smell good. spices in them. Okay, I'll be back when they cool off. Okay, I'm back and my cake has uh, cooled down now, so I'm going to put my icing on it. And if this, if I like this cake recipe, I might serve this one up as a Thanksgiving cake. But Two years ago, I made a carrot cake from scratch, and we will put uh, that video uh, in the description below, and I'm, um, it was really a good one. But I'm going to see if this fast and easy carrot cake, apple carrot cake, comes up to anything like that one. <laughs> I know it's a whole lot easier. <laughs> and budget friendly. Let me see, I get my napkin right here. I'll just use this piece of wax paper right here and put my knife on it. I think I'm gonna try this scary part right now. Oh, that came out pretty good. This is my little trick for making my cakes come out good. I put parchment on the bottom. Okay, now this right here, I think it's the low side. Okay, it's pretty even there. So now I'm going to put the thing on the top. This icing was really easy too, and I, I tasted of it, and I really liked it. So, I hope I have enough to go around on it, though. If I do, that'll be good. <laughs> So you could maybe double it a little bit if you wanted a thicker icing on it. I don't think the icing is supposed to be real thick on it anyway. make this go all the way around.
just about got all of that icing. <laughs> Uh, this was like just this cake right here was supposed to just have like a thin icing on it and uh, if you want it thicker like I say you can double your recipe so I'm going to do the taste test now let's see I'm going to go about right here I sure hope this cake tastes as good because it sure is a lot easier than making a carrot cake from scratch. <laughs> but this is an apple carrot cake, so that should make it even better. Okay, so let me have a taste of it. It's really good. <laughs> Marie, how does that cake compare to your um, your carrot cake that you make from scratch that you usually make every year for Thanksgiving? Well, if I had the the other cake mix, the better Crocker one, I think that it would taste a whole lot better. I'm not too good of a fan of Duncan Hines <laughs> but it really tastes good but there's no comparison to my <laughs> Made from scratch. yeah but if you're um, if you're in a pinch and you don't have a lot of cash this is an easy easy recipe to make uh, it's an easy it's fast yeah it's a fast and easy one yeah. We'll put a link to the uh, to the other carrot cake. I know it's a favorite. Your children really love it. Also, the icing didn't call for um, vanilla flavoring in it, but I believe if you put just a little bit of vanilla flavoring in it, it does have a little bit of a lemon taste. But I sort of like that. But if you don't like lemon taste, you could put just a little bit of vanilla flavoring in it. I think that would even make it better. Well, it looks nice. I can't wait to have a slice of it myself. <laughs> okay, we uh, like this cake today, this apple carrot cake. It wasn't as good as uh, my uh, carrot cake from scratch, but if you want an uh, easy, uh, budget-friendly recipe, I think you'll like this one also. So, I hope y'all have a good weekend, and do what you love, and love what you do, and Bye.